good morning guys it is day one in florida well technically it's kind of day one and a half because we did have a half day yesterday but we didn't leave the airport so i'm not counting that one uh, <laughs> but today or day two i think it's day two when it comes to what i'm writing uh the the notes on on the on the video because i added a little tag because vlogmas will end but our trip will still be going on so i wanted to have that extra series tag so yeah we've been sleeping we've been sleeping a lot we went to bed around six or seven and we have a sle we slept tea until five um so we did sleep pretty well i've was super frozen so i had an extra shirt while christopher slept like a rock so he didn't have any problem with it but i'm a little bit extra frozen because uh, basically at home i have two blankets somewhere <laughs> i have one thick uh duvet and then two extra blankets so yeah i'm very frozen uh so i woke up like once but otherwise it's actually been uh, pretty nice they, it's pretty nice bed I'm, I'm not in pain in my body which is good do have a splitting migraine but i think that is more a re uh, traveling migraine than anything else so yeah um it's it's we discovered last night when we turned off the tv that it's actually pretty loud outside i think we have like um the room next door is one of those with machines and stuff so yeah that's why so it was a little bit louder but it's okay we slept pretty well and it's it's been good uh we are now heading out to have some breakfast uh it's 6 20 in the morning we can't sleep anymore it just doesn't work we've been up since 5 30 or something and uh we can't go and get our car until earliest at eight we are going we have our time at nine but we're gonna go there at eight and see if we can get the car anyhow because um yeah we're a little bit earlier than we were but they don't open until eight so mm. but we thought we head down to starbucks because there's like two starbucks downstairs uh and have some coffee and some breakfast and kind of wake up but yeah good morning guys i hope you have an awesome day so we're back at the hotel we uh stepped out and went to starbucks uh we had uh cheese croissants <laughs> yeah it's not good for my tummy but i needed to get something and that was probably the most appetizing when i have this much migraine i just don't want to eat but i also know that i really need to eat so yeah so we had uh each a cheese croissant which was really good however the cheese was sugary which i didn't expect i thought it would be more like food cheese um when i was in greece when i was like 16 uh they had small croissant stands all over the place and you could get either chocolate ones or feta cheese ones and the feta cheese is is like this rich um soury cheese which is so good and um mostly it's goat cheese or no not goat um the other one lamb so usually it's lamb lamb cheese uh, made from lamb milk but um sometimes they do it from cows but it's super good so i thought i would get something like that and that was kind of sugary but it was okay the film film was on me and then we got each a latte and i got a chestnut praline 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 i have an extensive migraine today so excuse me if i can't pronounce things um but a chestnut latte and they're super good this is actually my favorite one i got it when we were in LA a couple of years ago I was super good and we don't get it in Sweden we get a similar one uh, the toffee nut latte but the toffee nut is slightly kind of sweeter while the chestnut latte ha has a more of a slightly bitter or sl taste of some sort it doesn't feel as sugary or as sweet and I really really like that so it's, it's my favorite one it's my favorite one um but yeah we are gonna get ready they don't open until an hour but we decided to actually pack uh check out of the hotel and then head over to um Avis and just wait over there instead <laughs> Uh, 
got to Whole Foods without incident. Uh, Christopher felt it was a little bit easier to drive in the state than he thought it would be, so that was nice. Uh, it's a little bit windy, it's a little bit chilly. I think it's gonna be like 17, 18 degrees today, but right now it's still uh, cold, morning cold because we got the car earlier, so we're on the road. Uh, we shopped for some food here at Whole Foods, uh, mostly like gluten free bars, uh, oatmeal, stuff like that. And now we're gonna head off to Target to pick up like the bigger package of water and stuff like that, and a spoon or a fork, something like that. But yeah, it is morning, guys, and it's very, very sunny, and I don't have any sunglasses on, so I look like a squint. By the way guys, uh, the car that we got is a Kia, K-A-I, and it actually got a lot of space uh, in the trunk, so we got both our big uh, traveling cases in the trunk. You don't have to worry about it when we are going that round shopping, so that is awesome. And also, it's white, and because it's so white, there's a reindeer car in front of us. Look at that. It has antlers and a red nose. Yeah, antlers and a red nose. I hope you saw that. Um, but yeah, so uh, it's a pretty good car and a big car. And it's a very hot car apparently when the AC is off. So uh, we're heading off to Target. We're gonna set up everything and, and go off. So guys, we have arrived at Sanibel Resort and Spa, something like that. It's an awesome hotel. And I thought I'd give you a little bit of a tour. So, first of all, there is actually bathrobes in here. You can find them. Da 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 da! Bathrobes! Which I think is awesome because I usually don't stay at hotels that have bathrobes. Then we have a go in here, but we're gonna do a little bit of a sidestep into the bathroom where we have mirrors basically everywhere so I can look myself fully. Uh, so, big sink really nice and then we have the bathroom which is smaller but i think it, i really really like it because this hotel is not about the bathroom it's about the view so we're gonna go into our bedroom which is a two queen size bedroom and then you have the like the ordinary we got an extra refrigerator i'm coming to that but we have like the tv coffee machine and everything the beds the beds we have an extra refrigerator because we like to have our own breakfast with us so that is how we're gonna have it and then look here guys let's see if i can open this it's inside this is our view have you seen something so beautiful huh so we got upgraded to the main tower, so I think that we were supposed to be in one of these sides. But we got upgraded to the main tower, and you have the pool, like a giant pool. It's not pool weather right now, but yeah. And you have, yeah. Have you seen? You can go out there. Yeah, I think I'm gonna like it here. We're staying. I think seven days, six days here. So I'm gonna be able to show you a lot of this area. So you know, we stopped by Whole Foods before here. We also stopped by Target and we got a few things and I thought I'd show you because it's mostly food, but you know, little food haul. I got this, which is a holiday tea. This is a gingerbread spice by Celestial. I saw the cute little gingerbread man, I just had to have it. I also got this one, which I actually looked into uh, getting directly from the States, because I really wanted this from the Republic of Tea, and they have had it! This was also got, we got from Whole Foods. So this is hibiscus, cranberry, hot apple cider and pumpkin spice. And I'm like, yay! This was what I wanted. And we're gonna go for the rest of our little food haul here. We got plastic um, spoons and forks and stuff. Mostly because this package was cheaper than trying to buy them one and buy one. So we got a whole package of this. Um, and those are the colors that these came in. 
these are from Targets and we thought we have like oatmeal or something in them so we got those two then we got some M&Ms we got hot cocoa or I got hot cocoa peanut for Christopher and holiday mint for me this is one of my favorite ones and I was really happy to find it today we also got some Swedish fish because we're Swedish and this is fish <laughs> um, got some probiotics these little bear thingies Christopher loves them so got a package for our trip helps our tummy cope um, I have also gotten a whole bunch of these uh, kind of bars gr gluten free grain bars I actually can eat them so I have the cinnamon oat the ma maple pumpkin seeds and the oats and honey with toasted co coconut and these are actually a little bit better snacks than just eating candy also got a package of in instant oatmeal original no sugar nothing it is for my breakfast and to finish it off we have our little refrigerator with some fruits and berries um, some lemonade water and cheese we don't have stringy cheese in Sweden so I bought all of the stringy cheese. wonderful we went that little streak and or that bridge thingy and we came out where the spa and the steakhouse is and it is so dense terrain just around the, where you can walk uh, and everything I don't know I have a dirty dancing moment because I loved the hotel they had at dirty dancing and this is like the hotel at dirty dancing Oh, things are sounding a lot. But yeah, I am, I am just super, super happy. And I couldn't be more happier. I am hoping that the rest of the trip will be as, as yeah, it's just great. <laughs> so this is a super cute little shed out in the middle of nowhere. I like sheds, they're scary. Think about all the people that can, that can like killed in there. I don't know. I think I watch way too many, way too many murder series. But honestly, if you would go in here and put a dead body in here, no one would notice ever. But yeah, I like it though. I like it. And the sun is finally out, so now the warmth comes. A little canopy to walk under and all the snakes in the leaves and yeah it sounds like I'm taking it badly but I really love this place really love this place <laughs> Thank you.
وقول لي هذا قلت We're thinking about how many hours we actually really did something versus uh, just driving or resting or anything like that. I don't know, it's, it's, it's been a really good day so I'm hoping to get a lot more out of this um, little vacation. A little thing we didn't talk about, uh, on the way here we stopped into Five Guys, which is a hamburger chain, and I really liked it because it was so simple and 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 everything. It was still just a hamburger. It was not one of those um, hipster ones that I got in, in places in Sweden. It's just basic hamburger, but it was actually really good. And their fries, divine, super divine. So that was our lunch today. And uh, we just went down and had our dinner and we actually chose to go to um, a restaurant here on the hotel, uh, Club Cabana, Cabana, something like that, Cabana Club, something like that it was called. Uh, they didn't really have that much for food, a little bit of nachos, a bunch of different seafood stuff, but as I don't eat shellfish, I can't really eat those. So we ended up having Nacho Supreme. It wasn't something like exciting, but it was edible. So we just put it into our tummies and then uh, we headed up. It's about uh, 8.40, 18.40, so 6, uh, 20 to 7. Uh, and uh, we think we're just gonna kind of hang out, do a few things and then head to bed. So I'm gonna edit this vlog. So that is one of the things I'm gonna do. Uh, and I think we're gonna like watch TV um, and kind of figure out what we're gonna do tomorrow. So those are kind of the things we're gonna do before heading to bed. We want to get to bed somewhere between 9 and 10 tonight. Um, so that we can kind of shift the sleeping schedule a little bit more because waking up at half past six when you have vacation mm, and I'm still exhausted from the trip so that's kind of the plan it is so beautiful here it's, it's a, little, a little slice of heaven it's really really beautiful I'm trying to just to live in it and vlog at the same time it's not easy but I'm trying to just enjoy it um, so far this trip has been wonderful and I'm hoping for it to be so much wonderful more wonderful uh, the rest of the trip but yeah I am going to do all the things and head to bed so I'm gonna say good night sleep tight don't let the bed bugs bite bye